Hey guys, welcome back. Super consistent YouTuber here. Today we're going to be talking about Angry Grandpa. More specifically, his son, kid behind a camera who's not nearly as entertaining, but <laughs> he is behind the Angry Grandpa videos, you know, the uploader and all that jazz. Now, I think I have to preface this by saying I've watched AGP content for years upon years. Some of the most fondest memories that I have in my life are watching those videos with my cousin, and I feel like they have a special place in my heart, so it's kind of sad to see them go, not only because AGP passed away, I think, about eight years ago now, but um, Michael is just doing weird content that <laughs> doesn't really, in my opinion, respect the legacy of what came before. I'm going to try my best not to disrespect Michael himself because he seems like a good dude. I mean, he bought his dad a house and, you know, he put together all this content for millions of people but um at the end of the day i think he's become one of the biggest leeches on this platform really really running home with a clickbait and just making up weird series and shit and i know some channels can get away with this but in my opinion michael can't <laughs> it's just again full of clickbait and it kind of got to a breaking point for me when i saw this so for those of you that are confused what you're looking at this is michael um promoting one of his shit series that's obviously fake on the angry grandpa channel which i think is in bad taste because that channel should be preserved as to what it is and what it was um, but he's trying to promote his own content that really nobody gives a fuck about on the channel about agp who i said like was the entertaining one michael has never been very entertaining if anything i found him very annoying so taking it over to that channel trying to get viewership from there in my eyes, is just weird and, again, distasteful. Now, I'm not the only one that thinks this. There are a multitude of comments. I think there are 222 comments in total. Mostly, if not all, people saying that it's disrespectful to post this on AGP's channel because, like I said earlier, it should be preserved, if anything. So, promoting his series on here that the subs really don't care about is weird. I don't like it. A lot of other people don't like it, and it shouldn't be done. But I think one comment in particular stuck out to me and really explains this well and kind of hits the nail on the head views are so bad you gotta use your father's account i only saw this first community post recently but he's been doing this for months like uploading and promoting his own content on this channel which again why the fuck would you do that if you want to promote your account don't promote it on your late father's channel that had much more entertaining content that was centered around grandpa not you there's no reason to post your shit on here Again, a majority of the comments, if you scroll through them, are people saying that we don't give a fuck because genuinely, why should they? Now, with that being said, I'm not going to run through Pickle Boy's rise and fall or anything because quite honestly, there are a lot of other people on YouTube who have done it better than me, but I just figured I'd give my two cents because this shit's kind of sad and again, fairly disrespectful, at least from my point of view and clearly the point of view of other fans as well. There are definitely some videos on Pickle Boy's channel that I have found myself enjoying after Grandpa's passing, so the entire series with McJuggernuggets was really, really good. I enjoyed that. I thought it was fun from both sides. Stuff like that is very entertaining, but when you make this very obviously weirdly fake shit and then you promote that on your Grandpa's channel, or your dad's channel, I'm sorry, it just looks kind of weird and screams, I need views. I need money, I need people to watch this, so you go to the more popular channel that people actually care about in hopes that they'll come over to you when in reality it's just making people dislike you more because I feel like the quality of the content has dropped significantly. I'd like to quickly clarify that I think there definitely were videos with McJuggernuggets and um, Kid Behind a Camera after Grandpa's passing, but I think the series that I'm mostly referencing was when he was around, but even then... He wasn't in the videos all the time, so it was Michael and Bridget holding their own and actually being really good characters in that series without Grandpa. One of my favorite videos from that series overall is when uh, McJuggernuggets and Parker are trapped in Pickle Boy's shed. I think it's fucking hilarious. Whatever script they used or if they were just improv it was so good, a lot of fun, and again, Grandpa wasn't even in that one. The entire plot synopsis was McJuggernuggets is trying to figure out whether Pickle Boy's videos are fake or not, and I found that really, really enjoyable. I just think that he's gone past his peak, and to be honest, a part of me can't blame him because, again, Grandpa was always the center of the stage. He was the main point of interest for those videos, so now that he's gone, 
what is Pickle Boy really going to do? He's just going to continue doing his vlogs and faking content because that's really all he has. He doesn't have a gaming channel. He doesn't really do challenges or anything like that. He just kind of records his life and, you know, eventually your life is going to get boring. So it makes sense to spice things up with scripts. But even then, it's not even just the content. It's the fact that he's putting it on AGP's channel to promote it when those fans do not care. I know I've hammered this point home like 15 times at this point, but I just really want people to understand that is my main issue. If people fake content and do series on their channel, that's fine. I don't care. Main point is A, he's putting it on grandpa's channel, trying to promote it there when he really shouldn't be, and B, the quality of the content has dropped significantly, i.e. a fuck ton of clickbait and no grandpa. With that being said, I'm going to end the video off here. Hope you guys all enjoyed that. Uh, it's one of those things to where I want to make a longer video, but there really isn't too much that I want to say about this specific topic. So the longer I go on, the more rambling I do. And to be honest, I feel like I've done enough of that. So I'm just going to, you know, I'm just going to cut. <laughs> See you in the next one. This has been Detail.